welcome to my channel today me and my mom are going to be doing how how to use a portable washing machine it's right here it's a very small one it's very nice uh it was a little i'm not gonna say expensive it was like 200 dollars with a protection plan but it was worth it and obviously we, we had a washing machine but i got like it was ruined so we couldn't use it so with this whole quarantine going on, we couldn't like, wash our clothes. Yeah, it well, was broken. Like I was washing clothes by hand, and I was like so tired and everything else. So yeah, I was like, you know like what? Workout. Let me go look into this into this portable one, which is really nice. If you guys can see it from this little tiny, I put it on the table so you know we can uh, have a little more higher. Okay, so now we're gonna get right into the video. So first off, what you need to do is you grab this tube that it brings on the side, and you put it. On the floor, if you're gonna go outside. on a bucket, yeah, on a bucket, and then after what you do is you grab buckets of water and then you fill that one up. Hold on, and the right thing to do is it brings some holes for this corner right here and also brings those holes to uh, basically drain the water out. But the, the holes from here is so it's so thin that it takes forever to, to kind of like load the water in. So we prefer to move it to this corner and just add buckets of water, which yeah. is faster for us. So first, let me open up the first one. We already filled it up halfway, but we're gonna fill it up even more because it needs to be higher than the clothes. What is the clothes? I think it's good. I think it's good. So we'll show you how it looks inside. It's pretty. It decent. I can say you can fit like at least ten uh, pieces of clothes. You know. We need the soap. It's uh, you see it small, but it's very powerful. Like when you turn it on, it's yeah, it, it, very it, it shakes too. And you put your detergents or whatever you're gonna put it to clean your clothes. But what do you normally do for a regular washing machine? Yeah. Okay. But you do not, if you buy this, you do not want to use hot water, like hot hot water, because um. Personally, I don't think it's supposed to have hot, hot water. Um, I it's bought plastic. this at Walmart, that website at Walmart for, it was $1.75, the original price. But with the protection plan that I put for, I think it was three years, it was like $18 more. And they shipped it over. It took about, it took about two weeks to get here. This whole quarantine going on, guys. But listen, I'm very happy. And this is an excellent thing. If you guys, uh, Example, live in a condominium and you guys need to go downstairs to be washing clothes you put this in and you plug it in your faucet good to go you don't have to um, you don't have to waste more money okay so now we're gonna be showing you guys how to turn it on it's like a regular one to turn it on so can you hold this okay so now you show them the inside of it so after you have all your clothes in there you close the the, the top of it and then you turn on how long you want it. I want it for three minutes. And it turns on. Depends on how much clothes you have in there. So this is the washer side and this is the rinser. This, after it washes, you can drain the water out so and it goes to this uh, pot. And then you pass it over and it and it, it, and it dries it. Dries it up. Like it doesn't dry it up, but it drains it out so good that, you it's know, dirty. it dries up in like not even half hour and if you have metal like zippers on your on your jacket say let's, let's say your jacket it won't burn because it, it just it's not it's not gonna turn hot like a regular one like you see how it's moving the table like yeah. it's, and, and it, it, it you'll find it weird because it kind of starts and then it stops and starts and starts but it's it, that's the way it does it because it, it goes one way to cycle and then the, it turns the other way like it goes rotating side to side so, so yeah, you see it. We're, like, gonna, we're gonna wait for a clothes to wash, and then we're gonna put it in this one. For while we're waiting, we're gonna be talking to you guys about I don't know. But then know. again, if you example um, have on this, uh, show the holes. It brings this hose to drain out the water. But if you want, you can add that, uh, another hose and make it get to your sink or to the tub or anywhere you wanna. Yeah, anywhere, anywhere you wanna, you wanna put drain it. it out. It's really cool, guys. I'm honest, and I. Give it a rate of five stars. It's Me like too. It's really so good. good. And I thought, honestly, I thought like I, I would have to wash one piece of clothes at a time. Yeah, because it, but in, it holds in up the, to ten or more. In the picture, it shows it looking small, 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 and it actually does a good job. And even my my, ki my kids could carry it. It's that like yeah. it's very nice and it's very powerful. If you can see. 
see it right now. It's like moving the whole table. Which every time I will to show you guys, it stops. <laughs> <laughs> hold it. Let's hold it. It's shaking it's right moving. now. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's shaking the whole table. I, I see it shaking. It's a very powerful. And it's very loud too. It's very powerful. Few more seconds and it's done. Wash and close. It's very good, guys. I'm very impressed. I, I was thinking, like, listen, if this thing doesn't work, I'm returning this right away. But hey, listen, it's it comes in very handy. Let me tell you. For all you single ladies, single guys that live in, in condos or any type of building that you can't have a regular washing machine, most recommend it right here. They're not paying me for this. I'm not promoting, but I'm telling you right now. It's amazing. It's almost done, guys. And we'll show you how we drain it and also how we 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 dry it. And the best part is that you can, it's basically the, the buttons are timers, so you can put whatever minutes you guys want. This thing is going to yeah. be on the table. So you guys can choose. You can put it for three minutes to wash, six minutes, 12 minutes. 15 minutes if you if it's like um if it's kind of a little bit on the more more close side then you want to put more minutes so it can wash really good and also guys uh let us know if, in the comments if you guys have one of these and let me know how you guys uh, how much you rate it let me know in the comments below okay okay so it's almost done it's literally about to stop I think it's up. Oh no, hold on. That's it, it's up, it's up. So it doesn't beep or anything, you gotta like be focused on it. It stops like a timer. It doesn't go beep or anything, it just stops. You'll see it goes in zero. So here, we have normal, basically it's washing and then here when you're done washing, you drain it out, you gotta tw turn it in order for it to drain the water down to the holes. And then here, this is for the, for the uh, dryer, for the rinser. Yeah, that insert. We dryer. don't have a dryer. It's just that we used to have a dryer, so I'm. I'm so I want to show you how, guys how we drain it out. So yeah, so when it stops. That the minutes are done. You hit drain, and, and then see how the water comes out, splashing. It comes out splashing. It comes out very fast too. Then all that dirty water will go down. How do I need those clothes dirty? Because look at the water's tough. Well, yeah. City. I put having. I put. I put that's wet. Okay, so now, guys, we are gonna be showing you guys how to dry it. I don't know. So that's what is coming out of the washer that I already washed and everything else. Now we're gonna pass it over to the rinser. Okay, so I'm gonna be showing you guys how to pass it to the rinser. It's amazing. Why? Because even kids can use it. Um. You know, not that the box says it, but my son obviously he's 10 years old and he can manage it. And the only thing I told him, of course, you cannot put your hands in while it's moving. You cannot try to stop it with your hand. You cannot try to do anything Especially while it's working. Especially in the rinser. Especially in the rinser because the rinser is your hand. pretty strong. Yeah, it's like so fast. Can't even see how fast it goes. And it's it's like um, when we first tried it, it was funny because because we thought she thought I thought it, it was him moving the machine and he thought it was me moving the machine. I was like, puppy. And then, um, so yeah, so this is a jacket that for some reason my son just wants to wash. Yeah, I wanted to wash this to show them how the zippers work. Why did you wash my... Okay, so now you close the hatch, and then you turn it on for how long minutes you want it. Usually you can do one minute to two, yeah, but and usually at one minute it's pretty dry. So, it depends so on how long you want to put it for. We're going to be showing, we should show them how wet it is first. Because they can see the difference. So. Guys, this is, is, is how dark it's it so, is. It's so dark and heavy. Okay, so now we're going to put it in. And if you don't put this leveled, it's going to shake like a... It yeah, it's going it's gonna to work. So you got to make sure it's labeled. Like, you, it doesn't, it can't be all on one side. It can't be all on, you know, it has to be like... In the, like, the whole, all the sides have to be complete. So, first off, you... Turn the, turn the camera on here. Yeah. I want them to see. So now you turn this one, and you turn it. So I want two minutes. See, you hear that? That's how powerful it is. It sounds like a car and a dyno. I don't know how many guys. How I many think you might need to talk louder, a little bit louder. I'm right here next to the speaker. Oh, uh, okay. So yeah. So I'm then after it, it grabs on to the to like the most of the water, 
It drains it out, it out here it. as well. You guys can see the dirty water. And honestly, it drains it out pretty good. I'm surprised. I was expecting like something, two pants, or like one pant and one shirt, that's it. Like I said, I'm not saying to let your kids use it, but if you think your kids are responsible to the fact that they understand they cannot put their hands in it, because this is pretty powerful. This, this can break a finger, break something. And um, This one, when it's off, you could put your hand in it to grab the stuff. When it's like, off? When it's off, only when it's off. If you, if only, I think only the adults could be doing that. Not this one though, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do this if you're an adult still. But this one, I think you're fine if you're an adult to do this because you're a little bit smarter than the younger ones. So this one is done. The it's thing is, I haven't tried this, but I'm gonna try it right now that you guys are there. This is a spinner, it's on right now. It's literally about to end, but I'm gonna see if I open this and it stops. It does. So I it automatically it stops. So that's a good thing. It's a safe thing for a kid in case that they try to open it to put the finger in or whatever. Um, once you close it, it goes back on. You hear it? That's part of it. So, it, I, I bet you it's kind of safe. The washing machine, you can open it while it's washing and it's still moving. So that I don't recommend to, to open because it does keep it, it, It's going to splash everywhere. But not this one. Uh, and this this one, uh, if, say oh. it's taking forever to shut off. Look, it's shutting off right now. It's shutting off right now. That means it's shutting off. Yeah, when it shakes, it's, that means it's shutting off. Okay, so now, let's see the sweater. It's a coat. Yeah, the coat. It's it's dried actually. It's half. It looks dry. gray now. Copy. Hold it the right way. It looks gray now. But if you want to put it to dry a little more, you can throw you it back in as many times as you want. Put it as many minutes as you want. And we're gonna put like half a minute in here. In a half a minute, it's like it dries a lot. What? So look, this is what I was showing you, right? It's spinning. It's like literally spinning. Once you open it, it stops. So that's a good thing. For and kids. there's also a second hatch too, just in case, because if they were trying to go fast, it wouldn't work. Unless they were like flash and they could do like boom, boom, boom. So. But always, always supervise your kids. Why? Because you never know what they try. You know, yeah. kids are kids are. Okay. They're yeah. gonna be kids and they're gonna try anything and everything. See, it stops faster when you open it. Because so yeah, it completely go, comes to a stop once you put this blue cap up. So this is the jacket. You okay. see, no water, no drips, no nothing. No more drips. Look, my head would have been wet. Like a jacket like this, I would put it like at least for five minutes, just so it can be like the dry, dry side. But um, in two minutes, it's kind of dry. It's not completely dry, but it's kind of dry. And the zippers, they're not as hot as you would usually get it's them. It's not dry, baby. Yeah, I know. So that's why these are not that hot. If anything, I would have let go of this a long time ago and this metal stuff on it. So now we're gonna show you guys the other pieces of clothing, what happens with them. So right here we got a towel. A towel. Towels it's, are very thing to to drain. Okay, so we're gonna see how. Let's how, show them how it's draining. Yeah, it's it still it's has wet. a lot of water. So now we're gonna put it in here. And then close it. And then we're gonna. And in one, one minute it's gonna be rinsed out, uh, uh, drained out. Look at the water's falling. One minute. Oh, look at drain. the water's falling. Also, what would you rate if you had one of these? Like, if you actually have one of these and you experience with it, uh, let me know what you guys rate it in the comments below. Mm -hmm. The comments are off. Mm -hmm. yeah. Coat is really dry. It appears dry completely. It's nice and dry. It is, and you don't see no drainage. You see it, like you should shake it. And if it you and squeeze it, it doesn't even drop water at all. Well, you gotta put and it this is so you can see the squeeze. Okay, the, the the it's done. The towel's done, so it's gonna start shaking obviously again. So that away, and then if you do this, it automatically. Now it's halfway dried. It looks a little bit dry. Nice and open, and it's like. And look at no more, can, no more water. You can spring nothing, drain it. Nothing is gonna happen. Like it's literally, completely like almost dry, almost dry. 
No, I'm not saying it's dry. It's completely almost. Yeah, almost. it like it like it's like uh, you can feel the water, but it's not dripping at all. It feels like it's kind of like. Okay, so now we're gonna show about you guys to dry. Uh, a shirt. How the shirt? Another shirt. It? Oh, it's, it's wet. It's thing. It's pretty. You know, you can see the water, guys. So now we're gonna put the shirt. You see, it looks kind of dark gray and it's throwing water and dripping and everything else. I think that's supposed to be black. That's I'm great. not sure. Okay, so now we turn it on again. Not even a minute. Put it half. The, I feel like the shirts it goes faster. You guys don't have to put one thing at a time. We're just trying to show you guys how it works. One thing. Yeah, you can put as many as you think. Yeah. Like, if it starts uh, shaking like really, really hard and it feels like like it's kicking type of thing, you gotta stop it because if not, it's gonna ruin the machine. Stop it. Um, take some out, or you can. Oh, take it out and put it back in, but make sure it's leveled. And make sure it's off too. And also, uh, I'm sure if you guys get like, there's a little space between where the where the rinser is, and there's a little bit of space between so where the done. opening is. It's done now. I'm gonna show you guys right now what I'm talking about. So let's go get the shirt. Okay, it's Is sort it of half dry. It's still wet, but it's fine. See, there's little spots. That's fine. So that was because those little spots are the only it was spots for water. It was because it was half. I, it wasn't I even a minute, to be honest. It's a shirt. It's a simple oh, shirt. We put it like. But you can put it as long as you want, like we said. You can choose what, how much, how well, long. See, thirty seconds. Okay, so now we got shorts. These like weird looking feeling look, shorts. Look at them. They're full I don't of know. Water. And and I don't know what type of fiber that is, but I can never ever get the water out of it. And you put it in the wrong so that's way. what happens. You see, if if you didn't level it and you just throw it in there, it starts. Kicking. It starts like making so much noise. So you gotta make it even that it's kind of like on every side it's leveled the same. Put it halfway. See. You so see? once you fix it, it goes normal again. Okay, guys. I, I need to go get a sock just to show them because there's thick socks that hard e you can get everything out of it. Sweatpants are really tough too. Yeah, they're they're the hardest, but it's like the fabric from uh, the the shorts. So yeah, guys, I highly recommend this little portable washer. Why and you can bring it anywhere. That's why it's portable. It's very easy to carry. It's very light. The reason I said once again this is why this is. Why it's shutting off guys it's shut off now we're gonna see how the shorts look okay they're still dark if my son keeps on throwing it up it's gonna end up in the pot of water but anyways that's the this way is it pocket. is you see you can't even see the water anymore the pocket's out it's fine that the pocket's out you see any water nothing at all okay uh what else there's nothing else in there i want well, to show you the inside that's the inside of the washing machine. It's pretty big. And this is the inside of the rinser. Bit drainer. So this right here, you have to take out because it keeps... I, when I you wash clothes, that out. I, when you wash clothes, it keeps the linen in there. So you might want to wash it so it can wash better. And also, uh, for the kids out there, uh, if you have to be like very strong enough to take that out, because it's very hard to push it so down. So what you do is you push it back in and rinse it out and it'll come up. Yeah. All the linen will come back out. See, you see the linen? That was from all the black clothes, especially that coat. Oh, rinse it on the back of this. Okay. So yeah, guys. I recommend it if you don't have the space for a big washing machine. It does not dry your clothes. It, rin it drains it out to a complete, like, to feel like it's almost dry. Um, it's, like I said, under supervision, kids can use it. It's very simple, very easy, right to the point. It comes basically like this. All you have to hook on is the, the holes for the water to drain in the washing machine. And the rest comes on. And this is it clean. That's clean. So then you put it back in, which you slide it in, and you clip it on this little... Don't shove it in because then it might break because it's plastic. You, you, you make sure it has some clips on it. Make sure you clip it on. And guys, unless you're outside, uh, you need a table and a bucket because uh, if you if you just use the floor and you have a bucket, it won't work because it's the the bucket is higher than the hose. 
so it holds them through anything out. It will just hold it. And only if like you're outside and it's like a place where you can throw out water. At. I'm not sure where that is, but uh, you throw the water. Like I'm pretty sure this could fit in a camper. Yeah, it's, I'm pretty sure. It is. It's a portable thing. It's basically but you can take. I've never seen a camper's washing machine. I've never seen one before. But at least a portable one. We have one. Yeah. Okay. Honestly, I give it a five star. I give it a five star. Let me know what you guys give it in the comments. Okay, so thank you guys for watching this video. I really guys I hope you guys enjoyed something. And if you if you learned something from this video, please give a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya. Bye. Bye. God bless.